Hey guys, it's Simply Imaginary People, and I was asked to make a tutorial on how to fix package files with duplicate images or incorrect images. So, first thing I do is I just open it in TSRW. So I just import it in. And when it loads, I just kind of look at which texture files it uses. being a bit slow because it doesn't like me recording. Okay, so I've got this overlay with these greyhounds, I've got this yellow mask, I've got this grey multiplier, my black specular here. I've only got one texture under here so there's no other ones. And under materials I also have this grey here. This diffuse map should actually be the multiplier, which it isn't. So all I'm going to do now is I'm going to go and open it in Sims 3P. If I find it. Okay. You can see I have a load of image files in here. So I'm just going to click on the first one. And I'm going to look at it, and I'm just going to keep my TSRW project open and see if it's in here. So this is like a yellow mask with the red dots down the middle. So yeah, I need one of those. That's the normal mask, but you can see here it has like a clown face here, so this is the wrong one. I'm going to delete that one. That's completely black. I don't have anything that's completely black because it was wrong. That's got a clown. Don't need that one. Also got a clown face. Don't need that one. Also a clown face. Wrong. Also wrong. Also wrong. Also wrong. Okay, we need a multiplier, which looked like that, I think. So, yep, one of those is correct. So we've got one multiplier, one mask, that's good. Don't have that picture, don't have that picture, don't have that picture. One specular map, also good. Don't have that picture, don't have that picture. Don't have that picture, don't have that picture. Don't have that picture. Don't have that one. Or that one. We do have this picture, but we've already got one of them and we don't need two, so I'm going to delete that one. Delete that one. Delete it again. Don't have that. Don't have that. Don't have that. Don't have that. Here we've got a normal without a clown. Good, we need one normal. We don't have that. We do have that overlay. We don't need it twice don't need it three times, and definitely don't need it four times. Right, so now you can see I've saved, uh, deleted most of these images. Now you can see this has 3.25 megabits. Now I'm just going to save that, close it. Now we are at 714 kilobytes. This is how I generally reduce my CC. So all I'm going to do now, is I'm going to go to new, and, oh, no, not wrong. Import it again. The one that we've now cleaned up. Right, you can see now some things are missing, like this overlay is missing. So all I'm going to go here is go to Browse. Because we didn't delete it, it'll still be in here. There we go. Done. There we go. Um, we got it back. Mask is still there, that's good. Multiply is still there, that's good. Specular is also there. You literally have to go through every texture and just make sure that all the files that you usually use are still there. If not, you're just going to have to browse. And press browse, do not import them. Not that you have them to import anyway. Diffuse map should be the multiplier, so I'm just going to browse for that. There we go. Normal map is still the correct one. And specular map should be the black one. This one. Right. And then you're done. So literally just delete any duplicate images and delete any duplicate images and just re well don't import them but browse for them in here if they're missing and that's it and then all I usually do is just export. I usually select them all, right click and say renumber second instance and make random. 
just press no on all the pop-ups. And then I go to export. And I export the package. And in that way I have now shrunk my package size. Well actually now you can see it's 6.99. And that's because I need to run it to do Sims 3 RC. So I'll let that run through and you can see I've gone from about 3 megabytes to 700 kilobytes just by deleting images that aren't even part of the package or are imported twice. And this usually just happens when people don't know that if you use an image twice you can browse for it instead of importing it again. Okay, so that was the short tutorial.